Cross-border shipping is important, and if I want to buy things from Switzerland or from Great Britain or from Japan or from Africa, um, it would be nice and I think it would be empowering to those sellers if we can make that better and faster. So it's, it's, all a, it's, it's another puzzle piece. It's not the biggest puzzle piece, but it is a puzzle piece. I, I wish we had the luxury of saying that local commerce will be the only driver of commerce, but I don't think that's really realistic. Ninety-five percent of Etsy sellers use their national post for delivery. I think the national post is the best carrier for dealing with small entrepreneurs. Um, they're the best point of entry for those people's packages. They generally provide the best rates. Um, so I think it's and, and these are people who know and understand their postage providers and their local post people. So I actually think. So as I said also when I was answering questions. I don't feel that Etsy is really ready for things like crowd shipping solutions. For us, our first, our first line of engagement is always right now through the local National Postal Service, which is why I'm here. I've never been in a room with so many postal and governmental representatives from so many different countries at once. So for me, you know, I was up there in my, in my talk saying, we need this, we need that. But for me to understand what people want from us and to understand the perspectives of people in different postal services, what the different conditions are in different countries, this is all really fascinating and illuminating, and illuminating to me. So to me, this, it's an incredible experience to be here and get a perspective on that.